Yeah, hi Axel, great to see you again. Uh, how does it feel to be back with the team after such a long time? Yeah, it was a really long time. Uh, you know, I have, I have the feeling like I'm a, I'm a new player uh, because I didn't see the boys and everybody uh, in the club for for now six months. Uh, but I'm really happy to uh, to be back and uh, and most importantly, I, I feel really good. Axel, hi. Hi. Um, you came here for two days. What what are your tasks here? Uh, you know, we did uh, the all the tests, uh, running tests, uh, everything we we have to do because then I think we don't have uh, the time when we go back to uh, to Dortmund because we already play uh, uh, on Saturday. So that's why we uh, uh, we came here just uh, this these two days to make uh, to make the test. Um... Yeah, how do you feel? You know, you, you were such a long time hurt. Then yeah. you played the European Championship. You played very yeah, good. Yeah, was not uh, was not an easy way. Uh, I had to uh, to work really hard to uh, to be fit and uh, and ready for the for the European Championship. Uh, and thanks God, I, I did, and I I could play uh, four games uh, without any 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 pain. So I felt uh, I felt really good, and I think it was a great, uh, really great comeback. Were you surprised a little bit about yourself? Uh, no, not surprised because, of course, when I got injury in January, uh, in my head I didn't think about uh, should I have to go, uh, you know, to the European Championship or not. Uh, but I think from uh, from end of March when I started to work, then. Uh, it's getting to my head, and I started really to believe I can uh, I can do it. Have you already spoken to the new coach, to Marco Rosa? You know what he what he wants from you, and you told him what you want from him. Yeah, we spoke uh, we spoke a little bit, uh, but I didn't train uh, on the pitch uh, yet. Uh, I think we will train uh, tomorrow morning uh, for the for the first time. Uh, but it was a great uh, feeling uh, with uh, with the coach, and I think all the. All the players have, uh, have the same uh, feeling. The training are not easy, really intense, uh, a lot of sprint. Uh, so it's it's different than the the years before. And uh, of course, this season we uh, we want to do uh, to do better. Mm -hmm. he, he yesterday or the day before yesterday, he was training a, a new formation, like in I don't know a diamonds. Um, huh? A diamonds? Yeah, a diamond. Yeah, great. Thank you. Diamond. Uh, there's just one one number six in this uh, yeah. system. Will it be a hard fight? For the for the um, first squad. Yeah, but you know, whatever we play the, the system. I mean, we we have a lot of uh, midfielder in the team, and uh, and also with a, a good quality. Uh, but I mean, this is uh, this is football. You know, you always need to uh, you know to fight to be in the first eleven, and uh, that's why football is beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, you know. They were training a lot of offensive here because there weren't any defensive players, more or less. <laughs> Will it be hard in the last week or last two weeks to get a yeah, defensive routine? Uh, no, I think we still, uh, you know, we still have, have time. Of course, not a uh, long time like uh, a long training camp, but we have still a little bit more than uh, than, uh, than a week uh, to work, and uh, we will do this uh, from from next week. Uh, I don't know Thomas and, and Jude when they come back. I think uh, uh, Monday, so everybody will be uh, will be involved and uh, and start working on the pitch. So we still have uh, we still have time. You have many problems in defense. Is it possible uh, that you are playing in the last defense row in the Pokal? Yeah. What did, what did you say? Is it possible that you are playing in the in last defense, row? Yeah. Like in uh, in Belgium against yeah. Brugge. Look, if I, it's not my my position. Uh, everybody know I, I like to to play uh, in a defensive midfielder, but in the end, if we don't have uh, enough defender or whatever, if I have uh, to play again at that position for for one time, uh, I will help the team, no problem. What are your goals for the next season? Your personal goals and of course the goals for the squad, for the whole club. Well, personal goal. Um, uh, I would prefer to speak about collective goal because uh, this is uh, more more important. Uh, I think everybody wants to be uh, to be champions, but for that we will have to uh, to be more uh, uh, constant in uh, in our game. Uh, you know, not to play uh, one month uh, in a high level, then uh, drop for for few games. 
so I think this is the most uh, important for us to be all the season constant, have the same the same level, and then uh, I think we can uh, achieve uh, something uh, bigger than than the last uh, the last season. Your captain Mark Roy said that uh, they have or you have a squad to win the title. Yeah, we have we have the player, but then it's, de it's depend of us. Uh, it's depend of how we uh, you know we're gonna be. Uh, during uh, during the season not only uh, you know for just a few months but the full uh, the full championship